Fast food tier list. Mmm. I gotta think about some of these. Arby's is probably gonna be D. I have never craved Arby's in my life. Who's buying Arby's? How are they even a franchise that makes money? I think Arby's is owned by Buffalo Wild Wings, and that's the that's the only reason why they're held up. Burger King? D all fucking day. That shit is terrible. Anybody like who who likes Burger King out there? Does anybody like Burger King? I've I've been in Burger King maybe twice in my entire life. I, I don't I don't like their I don't like the flame grilled nature of the burger. If I'm getting a fast food burger, I want it to be on a range, like a flat iron range, you know? This one right here. S tier, baby. What you know about that poor struggle, son? Little Caesars is S tier. Ain't no, ain't no way about it. Ain't no, I don't want to hear anybody else say anything about it. If you don't have Little Caesar at S tier, you grew up silver spooned in your mouth. Carl's Jr. Don't give a fuck about anything that Carl's Jr. sells. We had a Carl's Jr. at the corner, maybe a block from where I live. I didn't step in that thing one time in the 10 years it was open. And then it closed. I've never seen a fast food chain close and shut, shutter a store. That's how you know. Never heard one person say, hey, let's get Carl's Jr. And never heard, never heard fucking anybody say that about Arby's or Burger King, which is why they're all in the same one. Hey, you want to go to Carl's for lunch? I'm going to be like, who's Carl? Please, for the love of God, put Chick-fil-A in A or S tier. Chick-fil-A automatically goes S tier. The customer service, the way that they revamped their grilled chicken, everything about Chick-fil-A is S tier. Take that, Galaxy. Yeah. Chipotle, A tier. A little bit healthier. It's a super easy menu. Comes in burrito form or in like bowl form. Chipotle is S tier. Kind of expensive to be S tier for me. I'm not like, hey, I'm craving Chipotle. Let's go. I am like that with Chick-fil-A and Little Caesars. Though. Jeff Weed with the 100 bits. Galaxy said Chick-fil-A is hardcore B. It's a terrible take. He's too young to understand. He don't know. Next up, Domino's. S tier, baby boy. I don't know if y'all fuck with Domino's the way I do, but that's clear S tier. It's not even a question. They're, they're a hand toss. Chef's kiss, bro. Can I take a dono back? <laughs> Next up, the problem with DQ, because they are gonna go A tier, bro. And let me tell you why. Because their food is D tier, but it is completely overshadowed by their fucking ice cream. I hate Dairy Queen's food, but a blizzard with extra Reese's, that shit is S tier. The only reason it doesn't go up there is because their food's so ass that it brings them down a notch. Hate hated working at, yo, working at Dairy Queen gotta be terrible. Here's your blizzard. Because then you got somebody like me who, if you forget, I'm going to be like, give me that blizzard for free. You didn't flip that shit. Preeminent with the 100 bits. Wendy's better be S tier. Best burgers and Wendy hot. I'm going to do this for you right now just because you're leaving. Wendy's is S tier. Their burgers, out of all the burger places that are not Whataburger, Wendy's is is the best. Wendy's is S tier. With their with their natural cut fries with the sea salt. Bruh. Not even, not even close. And then you get the, and then you get a, a frosty with the fuck, with the, with the fries. Scoop it out. Bruh. Okay. So in and out is A+. Plus. I will give you that. I got a strong hatred for in and out because they are direct rivals with Whataburger, which is like a Texas staple. Like, don't fuck with us in our Whataburger, bro. But I do respect in and out because I've had it and I'm like, it's good, but it's not Whataburger. It's not Whataburger. It's what a burger, like W-H-A-T-A -A burger. Like, like, damn, what a burger. Look at, like, look at how good this tastes. Jack in the Box, garbage. Jack in the Box is straight ass. I, I don't... You're never gonna convince me that their tacos are good. That's it. Tacos are terrible. They make the taco and then they deep fry everything, including the lettuce and the cheese? Bro, KFC, y'all got KFC at B? That's a little low for me. I'm gonna be quite honest. You know why I'm only thinking KFC is A? It could, it, it should be B, but that famous bowl, bruh. The famous bowl and then you get a side of Mac and then you throw it in the famous bowl? I will say KFC's fried chicken is one of the better ones as well. I think I'm gonna go at A. It's going A just because of the famous bowl. It's $5, comes with a cookie, a whole ass drink, side of Mac in the famous bowl. If you haven't had that, go try it and then tell me that it don't belong in A tier. All right, McDonald's. Now we're getting into the ones where I don't know. Oh, uh, McDonald's. I wanna say it needs to be lower than what I'm probably gonna wanna rate it. I think McDonald's is S tier, yo. <sighs> Let me tell you why it's S tier. You can get a small fry spicy McChicken for $3. That shit is amazing. And then when the ice cream machine works, the ice cream is on par with Dairy Queen. The fries, the, the fucking barbecue sauce, you order a number six, which is the 10 piece with the fries and two barbecue sauces. The sweet tea is diabetically sugared, but that's fine. That's what America's for. What's America for other than to get diabetes and, and fun big pharma?
Let me tell you something about where this is this is really why McDonald's is in my S tier. McDonald's really came out here back in like 2003. They came to the boardroom at, at research and development and they were like, we need ideas for new breakfast. And then this motherfucker, I don't know, in the back of the room, how about we take a sausage patty and we put it in between two pancakes and then we'll inject those pancakes with a little bit of that guy went from that guy went from the mailroom to CA CEO of research and development in that one fucking instance. Crazy. Who has that idea? McGriddle keeps it on top. The sweet tea keeps it on top. Mick Cafe is amazing. 24 hours. Now breakfast round the clock. Then we got the fries. Then we got the ice cream when the shit's working. Panda Express, S tier. Even if it's just for the teriyaki chicken and the orange chicken, that's all they need. Panda goes hard. Never had Panda Tina? What better time than now? This tier list is ass, Galaxy. Your taste buds haven't fully developed. They don't fully develop until after you get a, a high school diploma. That's the problem. Next up, Papa John's. Oh, I cannot put Papa John's on the same level as Domino's or this one, but they are one of the better pizza franchises, so they're going to A. D tier, what is it about Papa John's that y'all don't like? Their crust is amazing. They, you know what it might be? It might be that the sauce, the sauce is a little too sweet. I will say that. Now we're on to Pizza Hut. Pizza Hut's gotta be B, you know? There's, there's just no way around it. Like it's not great, but and their service is kind of ass. Like their service is not the greatest, but they're like a staple of your childhood. Pizza Hut was way better when it had the old school layout, you know, with like the salad bar that you could just go in unlimited soup and salad. It's owned by Pepsi. Like they don't know what the fuck they're doing. Yo, old school Pizza Hut dining with that heavy ass glass like thing that said Pizza Hut on it where the light was. Shit is good. New Pizza Hut? Eh. All right, now we're moving on to fried chicken. I feel like Popeyes is gonna be higher than what people think. And to be honest, with with Pizza Hut with Popeyes chicken i can't put it i can't put it in the same aisle as kfc because I'll, I'll take kfc over popeyes all day every day popeyes is b and i'll tell you why they're not lower because popeyes mashed potatoes their rice nah maybe not their rice their mashed potatoes and their spicy sandwich they go hard that's the only thing that i'm ordering from popeyes if i'm ordering between popeyes chicken and and, and kfc chicken i'm going kfc 10 times out of 11 all right sonic Sonic is C tier, bruh. And it's only C tier because they have like a solid drink menu. That's it. I'm never craving Sonic. I don't eat Sonic ever. There's a Sonic to me closer than Whataburger, closer than McDonald's, and I would skip that every single time. Sonic honestly might be D, X-Gen. The only reason what's saving it right now is the fact that they have their drink menu. What do they even sell at Sonic? It's American food. It's fries. Oh, their tater tots are good too. Fries, tater tots, burgers, hot. Oh, their corn dogs too. The corn dogs and the... Ice cream are the only thing saving Sonic right now from being D tier. Subway. Now, this is where we start to get crazy. Because Subway's good, but it's just a fucking sandwich. That's it. It's an overpriced sandwich. Sonic is hands down better than DQ. Big Blue, their food is hands down better than DQ, but the ice cream at DQ is hands down better than Sonic. Subway is going to be A tier. Only because they're taxing out the ass. If, if there was Subway back in the 1700s, and we were paying what we were paying in the United States, instead of tea in the Boston Harbor, it'd be fucking Subway. That's how much they're taxing that ass on subway for a goddamn sandwich but nah they're gonna stay a because if i can look over the the homophobia here if i can look over the racism here i gotta look over the pedophilia nah i'm not even looking over it because they fired us that like when they found out they did something right away this one's gonna fuck y'all's minds these last two white castle d fuck that that shit's nasty taco bell Taco Bell might be A tier, bruh. Taco Bell might be A tier. I don't know if, and this is coming, and this is coming from someone who has Mexican food around him at all times, like authentic Mexican food. I have it everywhere. I could throw a fucking rock and hit three taquerias right now outside my house, but Taco Bell still be hitting though. Taco Bell's nachos are fire. Hey, you want to know what? You want to know what's putting Taco Bell at the top? It's gonna be the, or not at the top top, but a little bit lower. Baja Blast, caring big time, Rich. That's what I was about to say. Baja Blast, goat. One of the the goats of sodas and then on top of that their cinnamon twists had me at hello there's just something about taco bell that hits this is what i order at taco bell when i'm on when i'm balling on a budget i order one taco one burrito with no onions just a bean and cheese burrito cinnamon twist baja blast when i'm balling i just got paid from patreon or from twitch then we then we level it up to the to the doritos locos and it's cheap subway's death b i could see why people would put subway at b but i fuck with sandwiches heavy that's it for the fast food tier list. <laughs>